So let's look at some example. So one example, if we have absolute x is bigger than or equal to 4, then this meaning is any x value bigger than 4 unit or equal to 4 unit. Therefore, you can set up x is less than or equal to negative 4 or x is bigger than or equal to 4. If you make it on the number line graph, then it becomes from negative 4 going this direction. Don't forget this inclusive circle here. The right side from 4 going to the right side. Okay, so they are all um, basically a list of four unit answers. Now, the major part is we want to indicate it using the interval notation. So, now we need to divide two different sections here. So, this is one part of the answer, this is another part of the answer. So, answer will be indicated uh, using two different section range okay so first one so it goes forever basically it never stop it going toward negative infinity right and then remember that infinity value has a symbol and it's never stop it means it must be open set okay must be open set therefore in this case we can write negative infinity and then negative 4 this time become bracket and then or now this case minimum become 4 so bracket 4 comma it goes to past infinity so infinity there will be the answer for this problem now look at two more simple example but very special like an absolute y is bigger than or equal to negative 6 let's interpret it based on meaning so it means any y value or any variable this value is bigger than or equal to negative 6 units what do you think Can distance be negative value? No, right? So distance value is always greater than negative value. And this case, therefore, answer become all real values. So interval notation negative infinity to infinity. Okay? Then what about this question? I'm going to make opposite direction maybe. Absolute m is less than, I'm going to say, negative 5. Unfortunately, there's no value can be indicate less than negative 5 as an absolute value because absolute value means distance from the zero distance is always indicated by positive value so in this case answer become no answer exists basically okay then now let's look at a little bit harder and then maybe the question require a few more steps So one example is absolute x minus 12 is less than or equal to negative 8. If you think we just make absolute x minus 12 is between negative 8 or positive 8, or because as I explained around this part here, you may think, 
Oh, I see negative here, so I can say no answer. And that's misconception. Okay? You need to isolate this absolute value box alone, and then we need to reanalyze it. So we don't need this one. Okay? Therefore, I'm gonna take opposite number which is plus 12 on both sides and then simplify it and this become absolute x is less than or equal to 4. If it was negative 4, I immediately mentioned that no answer or I'll just say 4 or negative 4 because it includes equal equality as well. But now this is positive value. So now we can set up as we did before. So x is between negative 4 and positive 4. On the number line, negative 4 and positive 4, both should be inclusive circle and between here. Okay? And interval notation, you can make bracket negative 4, comma, 4, and bracket. Okay? Now, what about these questions? Absolute x plus 5 is less than 9. So, in this case, it's already isolate absolute box here and 9 here. And please remember, this absolute box, that value is fewer than 9 units from the 0. That's how you interpret it, this case. Therefore, we can set up x plus 5 is between negative 9 and positive 9. That's the right setup for this problem. And now, I temporarily erase this part here. Then, solve for x, what do you do? You combine, you substitute 5 on both sides, right? Okay. Instead, I erase this part here. You do the exactly the same thing. Therefore, even though we have these three different terms, you do exactly the same procedure for all three terms. So, minus 5, minus 5, minus 5. Then, x is between negative 14 and 4. Okay? So, on the number line, negative 14 and 4 this case exclusive circle or open circle and make this range or you can make open the parenthesis negative 14 comma 4 the parenthesis okay then uh, i'm gonna cover a little bit harder one for this case what about 2a minus 8 plus 3 is bigger than or equal to maybe 1. Okay. Then in this case, you isolate minus 3 first. Then absolute 2a minus 8 is bigger than or equal to negative 2. Now, we definitely isolate absolute value here. Now, it is always negative value here. So, you don't have to solve it. Just say, or real solution. Or negative infinity to infinity. Okay?